Okay, so this is a seems to be a neat trick that seems to be working. I just tried, so I had a bit of snow over the last couple of days, and it's covering up my you know, my clear panels that let light into the the greenhouse area. So it gives the chickens some more light in there. And I mean, not that I'm growing anything, but if I was growing anything, I'd need to keep the light going in. Um, so I wanted to clear off that roof, but I also wanted to be able to collect the, the snow, so I needed to be able to melt it. And the idea I came up with was simply to throw a little bit of, I think you can see that there, well, that little black speckles is um, powdered charcoal. And it really didn't take very much. Only about for this whole roof, just to lightly cover it, it only took about a cup of powdered charcoal. And um, it's noticeably, like the places I got, are noticeably melting quicker with a little bit of sunlight. And uh, today the temperature, currently it's 32 degrees. <clears throat> Excuse me. So 32 degrees, you know, barely, that's Fahrenheit, um, barely above freezing, right at freezing, and uh, with the sunlight hitting the charcoal on the roof, it's melting fairly quickly. So, and there shouldn't be anything, there's nothing toxic about uh, powdered charcoal, um, you know, it's from, a, I guess, an organic source. So out there, it gets down into my cistern, I don't think it's going to be a problem. Anyway, a bit of an experiment, seems to be working. Um, yeah, my uh, solar panels up the top, I got up there with a broom and just swept them off to get the electricity happening again. But I got some solar panels on the, on the actual roof area, which are just starting to poke through. Get some more down here. Right here's a good. You can see like there's a sec whole section there I missed, but you can see up above it where I got some, and the difference in meltage, if that's a word, is uh, quite substantial. So and, uh, yeah, water's coming down and filling my system.